you have to weave together a story of what you want and what you've done that makes sense for where you want to go. Your network, what you're learning here, and the story of how to, to continue to make sense of all that you bring to this work to make sense for, for the future. Even if you think that you don't qualify, even if you think that it's not for you, try every, because there are not a lot of opportunities in this field, my advice is to volunteer. So do whatever you can, even if it's not paid. I, I paved my, my way before this program and also during um, with doing a lot of volunteering uh, for the Harvard Mediation Program, for the Community um, Dispute Settlement Center in Cambridge um, and other organizations. And that's how you get a lot of experience and you can you know, build your resume. Find what you are passionate about. If you are in this program and you're interested in conflict, you're interested in people, find out what it is you want to do with people and focus your energies there. I was looking for jobs post-graduation with the word conflict or dispute resolution, right? And so I would go on to whatever job sites or whatever organizations I could find and I would be typing these things in, mediator, facilitator, conflict, um, and I was really not successful. And ultimately, um, what I ended up doing was I settled. I took a job uh, uh, referred by a friend for a project management position. Um, and I don't know how many of you are familiar with what project management is, but I definitely am not a project manager. Um, it, I'm not a taskmaster. I don't hold deadlines. I don't really actually particularly like detail. I was very, very bad at it. <laughs> horrible at it and um, what ended up happening to me was I took this job because I needed a job and I found in this role uh, I work for State Street Bank I work in corporate finance of all places um, I found that they were embarking on a large-scale transformation effort try what and find what you like these skills are so widely applicable and trying to focus your attention on the conflict resolution discipline it's very small it's a hard field to break into. And what I found for myself is that there's so much more out there. And I didn't even know change management was a job. Um, but I found myself in it. And I find these skills so wholly applicable to what I do every day. I don't think I would have this role or this job if I did not have my degree from UMass Boston. My manager frequently references that this is my area of expertise. And sh she's right. This is what we went to school for. So that's my advice to you.